Hello friends, welcome to BISP Solutions. Myself Ashwin and I work as a technical consultant at BISP Solutions. BISP Solutions is a tech company and provide technological solutions across the world. Now in this video, I'm going to show you how to use group criteria in suit analytics. Uh, let me show you. See, in our last session, we have learned about the in condition, the in criteria. I recommend you to watch my previous video where I have explained you the in condition. Select star from table name where in. Now in this video, I am going to show you the exist condition. Now consider this example, select the status from sales table where exist. Bracket start, select star from customer where customer ID equal to sales table customer ID and sales table customer ID equal to 1044. Now, normally in mysql database tables are connected with foreign key and primary key similarly here also we will not write the same condition as it is there are different technique to use exist now see here we will use here group criteria select a status from sales table that is okay and select a star from customer where customer id equal to 1044 now let me show you with practical here it is. First of all, read this show details. Status is in sales order pending fulfillment and customer customer ID contains 1044. Now see in the sales order, the status you will get the status and from customer table, you will get the ID. So we will use here how to use the exist in a different way in in the style of here let me show you here is transaction status equal to sales order pending fulfillment and here group criteria customer now similarly you can add here one more criteria as many criteria with the help of and or now how to create this i will show you let me open analytics in another tab here i have opened now we have to select the sales table, right? I'm going to select a new data set. Sales order. Okay. Now here is the sales order comes. Here there are different different information that we can see. Let me delete few. Customer is okay. First of all, we will select transaction. Inside this transaction, you will see the status. Here, status, I will drag it here. Now, pending fulfillment. Right? And then apply. Now, all the sales orders where the uh, status is pending fulfillment it comes here 177 total right but we want to extract only those where the customer is bisp infonet that is 1044 the id is 1044 now we will not add just below this we have to click here add new criteria right then we will click the customer because customer is also uh, associated with sales order with the help of primary key and foreign key. So I will click here customer. All the necessary information comes here. Then we will go here. Let me show you the ID. Here is customer ID right now i will drag it into here not here this is the sales criteria and here we will add the customer here contains 1044 apply now see here the 1044 it will search from customer and pending fulfillment already searched from sales so it means two uh, two tables are involved in this uh, criteria. Let me show you. 
Now see here, only four rows are extracted. Here is one zero four four one zero four four, where status is pending fulfillment. If I show you the sales order also, here you can see pending fulfillment criteria will be seen here. Pending fulfillment. So in this way, we can extract the data. With the help of add new group criteria. Now here also, if you want to add new group criteria inside, that is the nesting of query. So you can add as many uh, criteria. And here all the associated tables. For example, in sales order, the customer, the department, all these tables are associated. So that's why they are showing here. You just need to click here and uh, select the appropriate criteria and the value. Now see here, I will show you show details. Status in sales order pending, and then, and so this is the difference between the uh, simple SQL query and the suit analytics query. Here we have to apply the group criteria, and with the help of and and or condition, you can extract the data. So, guys, I hope uh, this video will be helpful for you. So, keep practicing suit analytics and uh, subscribe my channel. And if you have any doubt. You can write down in the comment box. I will try to satisfy your query. Till then, thanks for watching. Goodbye. Thank you.